here next topic comes sharing information it is important that you know how to use your phone properly when sharing any information and create some basic security habits in order not to expose yourself remember there is a record of everything especially when you use a device like a smartphone you may not realize there is one ip address when you are connected to a network even if you are just on the cellular network so you need to be careful before you are sharing any information scams can also be done using text messages we discussed about scams through websites and especially in emails but they can also come in text messages don't sign up to a lot of things with your phone but if you do you will be more prone to such scam messages never reply to any messages asking for any kind of personal information use common sense with personal details don't share any personal details with anyone small screen means read carefully when you download or install anything read privacy policy terms of service or terms of agreement carefully as many hidden things might be there if a picture video or any message is sent you cannot delete it from the recipient's device in whatsapp you get some time to delete it for the other party but after that time also if it is sent then you cannot delete it from other person's mobile so once it is gone your things can move around anywhere it doesn't matter how much you know the other person relationships change and your information can be misused so think before you send double check the recipient before sending we all make such mistakes sending message to wrong person like sending message to amit instead of amita or any other mistake so double check the recipient before sending set your location off for those apps which doesn't require it activate a screen lock after a short period of inactivity your phone should auto lock itself it is recommended not only for your mobile device but also for your laptop or tablet this is the easiest way to protect your information you enforce automatic wiping of the device after 10 failed login attempts the reason behind this is that you can never know where you will accidentally forget your phone and who will end up accessing it no matter how protective you are with it there is no guarantee that it won't end up stolen one day you can simply leave it on your table while in a coffee shop or at work for a break and someone will check anything or even worse install a key logger or screen recorder on it so be careful whenever you share any information on your phone i hope you enjoyed this session thank you